Hi boys and girls, it's Miss Reynolds with Bored, Better Off Reading Every Day. Today's book is Pete the Cat and His Magic Sunglasses by Kimberly and James Dean. Pete the cat did not feel happy. Pete had never, ever, ever, ever been grumpy before. Pete had the blue cat blues. Then, as if things were not bad enough, along came Grumpy Toad. Grumpy Toad was never happy. He always wore a frown. But Grumpy Toad was not grumpy today, he said. These cool blue magic sunglasses made the blues go away. They help you see things in a whole new way. Pete put on the cool blue magic sunglasses. He looked all around, right on. The birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining, I'm feeling all right, right on. thanked Grumpy Toad for the cool blue magic sunglasses. He went on his way and soon he saw Squirrel. Squirrel did not look happy, Pete said. What's wrong, Squirrel? I'm so mad. Nothing is going my way. I only found one acorn today. Pete said, try these cool blue magic sunglasses. They help you see things in a whole new way. Squirrel put on the cool blue magic sunglasses and looked all around. Awesome, the birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining. I'm feeling all right. Pete said goodbye to Squirrel and continued on his way. Soon, he saw his friend Turtle. Turtle did not look happy. What's wrong, Turtle? Pete asked. I'm so frustrated. Nothing is going my way. I am all upside down today. Pete said, try these cool blue magic sunglasses. They help you see things in a whole new way. <laughs> Upside down. Turtle put on the cool blue magic sunglasses and looked all around. Far out. The birds are singing. The sky is bright. The sun is shining. I'm feeling all right. Pete kept rolling along until he saw Alligator. Alligator did not look happy. What's wrong, Alligator? Pete asked. I'm so sad. Nothing is going my way. No one wants to play with me today. Alligator put on the cool blue magic sunglasses and looked all around. 
the birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining, I'm feeling all right. Pete was rolling along and feeling all right when suddenly he fell back. The cool blue magic sunglasses went crack. Uh-oh, Pete didn't know what to do without these glasses, those glasses. Just then, Pete looked up at the tree. Wise old owl said, Pete, you don't need magic sunglasses to see things in a whole new way. Just remember to look for good in every day. Pete looked around without his sunglasses. Too cool. The birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining. We're feeling all right. Boys and girls, that is the end of Pete the cat and his magic sunglasses. Now I want to take you back to a specific page when I realized that this was an awesome story. I mean, I know it all along, but this part made it good. The cool blue magic sunglasses went crack. Uh-oh, Pete didn't know what to do without his sunglasses, those sunglasses. Just then, Pete looked up to the tree and wise old owl said, Pete, you don't need magic sunglasses to see things in a new way. Just remember to look for the good in every day. Look for the good in every day. God, I love this book. And then this page, all of his friends that he helped to feel better, everybody, is right there hanging out having a good day with Pete and that's what it's all about finding the good in every day finding a way to feel good about everything that's going on boys and girls this is a pretty awesome story look at that all his friends too cool is what he said which too cool so boys and girls of course, I chose this story because <laughs> sunglasses, hello, these are prescription sunglasses. That's, that's the only reason why I'm able to wear them and read to you because they are prescription sunglasses. They make it so that I could see even while it's dark. Yeah, mm -hmm. specially made. I treated myself. Now, boys and girls, look at this lady here sitting with her sunglasses reading on top of her school stool. Who does she remind you of? This is a salt and pepper shaker. She's just sitting there on top of her stool, reading her book. Yep. There are a lot of sunglasses here. Of course, I cannot try on all of them. But one of the things I wanted to tell you is about actual seeing and about how you don't have to be able to see to be great. Andrea Bocelli is one of the greatest singers in the world. My personal favorite. I try to go to his concerts every year when he is in New York. I think I've gone to like 10 in a row or something like that. And the reason why I love him, aside from the fact that he is an awesome singer, and a great dad, because I see him all the time with his daughter on the web doing all kinds of fun things, is that Andrea is blind. If I'm not mistaken, I believe it to be true, 
He has been blind since he's eight or 12 years old. He was originally going to be a lawyer and then he became a singer, an opera singer, and he does it like no other. So boys and girls, see what I'm talking about? You don't have to be able to see and wear glasses and all that good stuff to be great. He is blind and he sings like no other. So that's why I put this shirt and the glasses together. Because remember Pete the Cat felt like he needed glasses to make the day feel better? Nah, mm -mm. that's not how it works. It's a great idea. And of course we look good in glasses, but you know, some of us can just have a great day without glasses at all. Look, so we got the white glasses. We got my wedding glasses that I wore at my wedding to take my wedding pictures. These are about, they're gonna be 18 years old because I was married a long time ago, back on July 14th. So these were my wedding glasses, what do you think? They matched my dress. These are birthday glasses. Happy birthday to you. These are the ones I wear whenever I do the birthday books because they have candles and cake. Then I have Philadelphia Eagles glasses. Yes, for the team Philadelphia Eagles football. They did win the Super Bowl one year and those are their glasses. I'm working on some Mets glasses next. We got my pineapple glasses. Oh yeah, pineapple. And I don't wanna knock anything over, but I am gonna show you my all time favorite glasses. It's this one. Ooh, don't knock it over. It's this one. Now look at these. They are folding glasses. They're all folded up. You open them like this. Isn't that cool? And then you just put them on. What do you think? Do you see what I'm talking about? Just throw on a pair of glasses and everything looks better. So, those are the glasses that I'm gonna show you today, boys and girls. And I read this book to you because I just wanted you to have a sunny day. And on a sunny day, we usually wear glasses. It's Miss Reynolds with Bored, Better Off Reading Every Day. And I hope, like Pete the, the Cat, you find good in any day, whether you're wearing your sunglasses or not. But if you're wearing your sunglasses, of course, it's going to be a super cute day because you're super cute. It's been my pleasure to share these glasses and this book and Pete the Cat with you. Bye.